Hi everyone, Carol from Carol's Vintage Treasures. Today I have a what sold video and a Goodwill haul of things I'm going to be listing throughout next week. So you can kind of get a sneak peek of what's going up in my store. And I will put the link in the description if you want to take a look at that and see what progress I make during the week. Did a bun today. Look at me. <laughs> I have more time to play with my hair now. Uh, I'm telling you, being off of a regular job and just being home working has been a godsend. My body is feeling better. I'm not taking Tylenol every four hours. It is amazing. So, <laughs> enough of that. Uh, what I sold this week. I sold a keepsake album. This is by Hallmark. It's in the box. And that's what it looks like there. Sold for $18.74. Doesn't look, it's brand new, has never been used. It's got a place for pictures, got a place for little keepsakes to put in there. And I thought I saw a date on there, but I'm not sure. Wedding reflections, I don't know. These were really popular. I know I had one when I got married, which I ended up destroying when I got divorced, but that's for another show. Anyway, I sold that for $18.74, and I also sold a ring. I got these little boxes at Goodwill. There was a whole bag of them, and I picked them up. And they've even got the little cushion stuff inside. And this is the ring that I sold. And I swear, I was just looking at this ring the other day, saying, why hasn't that sold yet? That's so pretty. And it's just a little stretch ring, but it's really beautiful. Sold for $14.99. And when I sell my jewelry, I always send it out in a box with lots of bubble wrap. Uh, I put bubble wrap inside so it doesn't move around. I put bubble wrap on the outside of this, and then I put it in a bubble mailer. And I haven't had any complaints about it getting to anyone damaged. So that's been working for me. Uh, it cuts down on the postage too. If you can send it in a small bubble mailer, it's much better than sending it in a box. So, did I show you my shirt? This is another Timu shirt. It says, being a functional adult every day seems a little excessive. And it's another one of those shirts for $5 or under I did that video on. Um, that's back a ways if you want to look for that video. But I told you I would wear each one at a future video to show you what they look like. This is an extra, extra large. It fits good. It's comfortable. I always get them a little bigger because just in case they shrink and I like wearing bigger things. I don't like. All right, Miss Nosy. Holly's down there looking at my next guest. I don't think I can get her to come up here. She's being difficult. She's being a diva. Okay, I plan on listing this guy. He is a Build-A-Bear and I got him for $349. I will be listing him in my store. He's a chocolate lab. This looks like your mama. Your mama looked like this. Your mama was a chocolate lab. Yeah. So, <laughs> that little guy is just so cute. And this has been working great for me because it's holding me accountable. It's making sure I get these things listed. I got all the things from the last What Sold video up in my store listed. If you want to take a look at that, go ahead through the link in the description. I'm going to be doing this beautiful glassware. It is Italian glass. It was $24.99. I did not pay that much for it, but isn't that beautiful? It came as a set. I don't know if I have the whole set here or if I put them in different containers but I will be listing that. And I'm not sure if it's going to be in a set or not, but this is part of the set. This was also priced for 
although I did not pay that much for it. Isn't that beautiful? And I know it's Italian glass because one of this one of the pieces had a sticker on the bottom. Yeah, it says white crystal, handmade in Italy. So you can also tell sometimes by doing a Google image search and try to find something like yours. Maybe someone had listed one before that had a sticker on it or something of that sort. And you can find out more about your item that way. Okay, here's another piece of it. It was also listed for $24.99. Isn't that just beautiful? I don't think I will sell them as a set because it would be too expensive for someone by the time they put the shipping on it and everything. I think I'll just list them separately. But only that one had a sticker on it though, but you can tell it's all from the same set. It's really beautiful. Okay, excited about that. I will also be listing this little tiger figurine. He was priced at $4.49. He's really cute. He's got a rough spot. Oh, is he chipped? Dog on it. I think he's got a little chip on his nose. I thought that was paint, but I'm not sure. I'll have to look at it closer but it does not take away from his beauty. So I will be listing him. If he has a chip, I will disclose it. Here's a little cream pitcher that I found for 99 cents. It's really beautiful. It's got, I think it's supposed to be that way with the crazing as part of the design, but it's really beautiful. And I know it comes as a set. I have seen it with the cups and with the um, decanter and the sugar bowl before, but I only found the picture on this day. It's really pretty. I'm also going to be giving this little girl a chance. I thought she was a piggy bank, but she's just a figurine. Isn't she cute? That would look great on a baby's room shelf. Uh, she was $2.49 and it is a, I think it's a student pottery piece. There's a little marking on the bottom. But isn't she just so sweet? And with the yellow, it could be for a boy or a girl. Mm -hmm. Do not want to break those. <laughs> All right. I'm going to be listing this art glass vase. It was list. It was eight forty nine. Really beautiful purple with the um, blue leaves, I believe. And I'll have to figure out more about this too. I'm not sure, but I thought that was really beautiful, especially if you like purple glass. If you've been watching my videos for a while, you know I'm a big fan of the glass. I think this is the last thing. Yes, I know I'm bothering your nap. Another ginger jar. I've been listing quite a few of these. This is the red one. It's really pretty. I don't know if this would be a ginger jar. It's not really tall enough. I think I paid. It looks like $6.49 or $5.49. I don't know. The sticker's been ripped off. But let's try taking this tape off and show you. That's what it looks like inside. It's just really pretty. I love that red color. And it's got the Chinese marking on the bottom. Very pretty. And uh, I'll be listing that too. So watch my store within the week. I will be putting this up a little at a time, along with other things. I've been setting myself a goal of five items a day. And also, if I can get more than that done, great. I will just start on new things. 
Are you gonna start growling? Okay. Hey, you have to be good if you're gonna be down there, okay? You cannot be noisy. You have to be a good girl, okay? Yeah. So, I am excited. I think I picked out some great things to list this week. And especially the white crystal. I love this. So beautiful. And I would love to list it as a set, but I just don't think anyone would buy it at what I would have to price it at. Uh, especially with the shipping that's going to have a heavy duty shipping price. My girl, you need to be good. I know you're always good, right? She has been very good. Do you want to come up and say hi? No? You just want to stay down there and, and voice your opinion? No. No barking. You can come up if you want to say hi. Come on. Come on. All right. Stay down there and be a little diva. Oh, you want to come up? You want me to scoot over? Okay, I'll scoot over. Here, you want to come up now? You want to come up now? Oh, now you'll come up. You wanted to be the center of attention, huh? And now you're going to turn your back to everybody? What are you going to do, huh? My sweet girl. She's been very good lately. Yes, she has. You're adjusting to me being home more. I know. I know you're such a good girl. You really are. Loves giving the kisses. So let's do this a little bit. There. That's a little better. Not really. Now you're crooked. There. There. So it's just about time to say goodbye and you come, decide to come up here, huh? <laughs> you are you're our mascot. I wish you could see how she's sitting right now. She's got one leg hanging off. Oh, I'm not moving the camera again. That's annoying. But two sales this week, not bad. I think it's going to start picking up now that I'm listing every day. And I sold this hairstyle from Misty. I don't know if you watch Misty or not, Thrift or Junk Dirt. Thrift or Junk or Vintage Hunter. She gives a lot of good tips on reselling if you want to watch her. Uh, she sells on eBay and she has a vintage marketplace also, which she is a part of. Oh. Hey, hey, I'm talking, do you mind? And uh, she's, she's got a really good channel. I will link her channel in the description if you want to take a look at it, along with all my stores and stuff. Oh yeah? Are you getting more comfortable now? You didn't like your your leg hanging off the couch, huh? Yeah, I know. You're a good girl. <sighs> so, I guess that's it for today. Just came on to show you what's sold and what I'll be listing throughout the week. Ah, oh, there she goes. Now you can relax, right? Now you can relax. So it's been a great week. I've really enjoyed um, just being at home and working on my reselling. Uh, I'm not having to take Tylenol every four hours like I was. I was taking some naproxen in the morning and then Tylenol every four hours. And I was still hurting like crazy. So I'm really not hurting anymore which is amazing. It's an amazing feeling. I'm starting to feel human again. And I know a lot of you have said in the comments, I look more rested. I feel more rested. I feel great. I really do. So I just got to get that income coming in now and I will be doing great. I'll start doing some shopping videos and stuff like that. Um, just, I think I have a thread up box coming too. I'm not going to be doing too much of those in the future. They're very expensive. But, you know, I've got my Shop Goodwill auctions that I won coming in. I've got three of those. 
and I think we're going to have fun together. So stay tuned, subscribe if you have not. Uh, it's going to be a great journey. Um, starting to sell, re resell full time. If you're just here today for the first time, I quit my job last week. Uh, I just couldn't do it anymore. It was very hard on me. And uh, I'm getting a little bit of Social Security and I have a little bit of savings. So I figured this is the time to go ahead and try this. And if it doesn't work out, I'll get another job. But I'm going to give it a real good try. And that's it. <laughs> uh, thank you for your suggestion on the fruit fly problem, by the way. Um, I did get one of those Zevo uh, things that you plug into the wall. It was expensive, but worth it. There are so many fruit flies in there. Um, someone have had, uh, 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 the name escapes me, but you know who you are. You suggested I have more than one, and I did. <laughs> There are a lot of fruit flies in that little light thing, and I hope it catches all of them because I'm tired of it. <laughs> I did see one flying around here earlier, and I was like, go to the light, go to the light. <laughs> That's kind of funny because my name is Carol Ann. <laughs> and ever since I saw that Poltergeist movie, I'm like, oh, great. <laughs> but... I am enjoying myself. I think Holly's enjoying herself, although she is a little perturbed that I'm home more. She doesn't get her good nap. But it's okay, right, girl? You get more cuddles. I think she likes it deep down. So that's all I have for today. Make sure you like this video if you enjoyed it. Um, comment down below. Let me know how you're doing. And subscribe if you haven't. I'm trying to get to a thousand. I'm halfway there. Uh, we're over 500 now. Thank you so much to all you people who have subscribed. It just means the world to me. And that's it for today. You have a lovely day and I will see you in the next one.